Hello and greetings to all of our Central Ohio Technical College soon-to-be graduates. Uh, this is John Barry, the president of COTC, basically coming to you from the president's office, getting ready to send you a moment and heartfelt moment of appreciation and gratitude. So uh, I am here in my office in full regalia, as I would have been with you during the commencement ceremony that we had so wanted to do, uh, but I thought it was very important that we still provided you some measure of this experience, at least from a distance for today. Uh, you may see that we have our institutional mace as part of this process as well. So I'm going to speak to you a little bit from the heart, and then I'm going to do a quick ceremony with you more from the head. Uh, from the heart, we extend our congratulations, our recognition of your achievement. We couldn't be any more proud of you. We are sorry that we can't actually hold a physical commencement ceremony with you at this moment, but do know that we do plan to invite you back for our next opportunity to do so. But we would be remiss not to recognize your achievements at least this moment in time. So that's sort of the heartfelt piece. I actually have a full script that I'm going to work with as we would have in your actual ceremony. So bear with me and we'll go through this process short but sweet. Good day to everyone. The faculty, candidates, and guests of Central Ohio Technical College may not be able to gather collectively at this time, but we extend our heartfelt congratulations to each and every graduate of COTC this spring of 2020. We would be remiss not to mark this momentous occasion, graduates, and share a sentiment of thank you to each of you who have steadfastly committed to completing your arduous academic journey you embarked upon so many years previously. So too must we recognize and thank the many family, friends, colleagues, and loved ones who have supported you through this process. As the president of Central Ohio Technical College, I am delighted to congratulate the class of 2020 on behalf of the faculty and staff of COTC. 2020 has brought with it many reasons to celebrate, as well as many challenges and obstacles. Some of you may celebrate today. Uh, I am titling this short recognition program as graduation during coronavirus, a little pomp under the circumstances. Obviously, this is not to the format and the occasion we had planned for each of you. Of course, we are sending you your certificates and degrees that you have earned. However, please know you will also certainly be invited and encouraged to attend our next face-to-face -face commencement ceremony, which is scheduled for December 18, 2020. The Alumni Association of COTC will also be sending you congratulatory items in the very near future, welcoming you into the vast network of COTC alum. That being said, we need to mark this special moment in time as the point where we acknowledge the hard work, dedication, and commitment each of you has demonstrated. You have completed your academic pathway, you have achieved your goal, and you are being recognized as a college graduate. Graduates, you must be proud of that accomplishment. I encourage you to share the pride that you feel today and extend it to others. You entered this college as students and will leave as alumni, confident and ready for your next steps. And this is a tremendous achievement. Congratulations to you. I want to just briefly recognize a few caring and dedicated people who have supported you along the way. The faculty and staff of COTC play a crucial role in bringing the graduates to this important milestone. Each member of the faculty, as well as the staff, extends their enthusiastic congratulations to you and sends a virtual hug as well. It is customary for COTC to present the Teaching Excellence Award during your ceremony. You submitted your nominations and played a role in selecting the recipient. So I want to briefly recognize the faculty who exemplify excellence and dedication to both the students and their profession. The 2020 Full-Time Teaching Excellence Award recipient is Dr. Kimberly Gowdy, Professor of Business Management Technology. You said in your nomination, Dr. Gowdy exhibits a true passion for teaching and instructing. And during those stressful times, both personally and academically, she was always there to motivate me and remind me of how much of an asset I was in this process. Finally, she is always willing to go beyond what is expected of her position and the interest of the students uh, in, in that the, fully, the student fully understands and is learning on the level that makes the student receptive to alternate techniques and views. My thanks and congratulations to Dr. Gowdy. The 2020 part-time Teaching Excellence Award recipient is Pamela Kirst, who teaches English and Composition. You wrote, she makes you leave class with a sense of pride and motivation to continue on. She encouraged peer involvement and had everyone making friends the first day. Her class is full of laughter and long lasting knowledge that you don't forget. And I feel I am a better writer because of her. 
congratulations to Miss Christie as well. Now back to you graduates. This is a moment that we officially acknowledge your achievement from student to graduate. Please listen and heed the following words well. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Central Ohio Technical College Board of Trustees and the State of Ohio, I confer upon you the appropriate degrees and certificates with all the rights, privileges, and duties pertaining thereto. It is my honor to be the first person to applaud your achievement. Now I will leave you with a few words of personal advice. You have certainly demonstrated your ability to be successful. You have completed all the requirements of your certificates and degrees. My challenge to you now is to take the next step and move from success to significance. Be significant to your communities. Make your mark and contribute to the greater good. Continue to make your alma mater, Central Ohio Technical College, as proud of you in the future as we are of you today. With that, I will share with you what I call the recipe for forever. Recipe for forever. Gather all the ingredients together so that they are close at hand. Get a clean cloth and wipe the bowl clean of any lingering dust from the past. Take maturity, respect, and friendship and stir gently. Add unlimited amounts of compassion and kindness and mix well. To this, add caring by the handfuls and fold in trust. Continue stirring gently, adding listening, honesty, and a large amount of communication. Slip in some dreams, goals, and firm pieces of keeping promises. Bake in a home filled with peace, beauty, and serenity. Before you taste the finished product, sprinkle liberally with patience, love, and a touch of spice. Serve very hot with imagination on the side. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the President's Office of Central Ohio Technical College and the faculty and staff of our community, we congratulate you today. You have really done something significant. Take the next step, continue on this journey, and know that we are so very, very proud of you. Thank you.